Hey guys, this is Mr. A Chrissy here, and welcome back to another movie review. Today's movie review is going to be on the new movie that that came that came out uh, that came out two weeks ago, and, and of course I, I finally went and saw this movie with, with my dad and uncle Charles last night at Regal, and that's going to be on The Northman. The Northman is directed by Robert Eggers, and and the story of The Northman goes like this. Prince Amleth is is on the is on the verge is on the verge of of, be, of becoming a man when his father is brutally murdered by by his uncle who kidnaps the boy's mother. Two decades later, Amleth is now a Viking who raids Savlik villages. He soon meet, meets a, a Sirenus who 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 reminds him of his vow and to save his mother and kill his uncle and avenge his father. And of course, that's the story of the Northmen. So. Like, remember, remember when I, when I said that when I said that that I, I was gonna check this movie out on Blu-ray? Well, well, just like just like always, I changed my mind once again. So, cause cause the reason why I changed my mind is because it had it had me very interested since since I know since I knew last week there was nothing interesting that that came out last week. So, so 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 me and Dad and Uncle Charles decided decided that we should all see The Northman, and you know and like we. And plus, you know, we we all went and saw this movie yesterday, and and I gotta say, me and Uncle Charles and Dad, we all three of us actually liked it, and and, and I personally loved it as well, and uh, and if and, and of course, The Northman is also one of my all time favorite films of twenty twenty two as well. Yeah, because and because the reason why is because like the way they shot this film, like the like the film the filming and cinematography is very nice and. And and of course the director Robert Eggers. Robert Eggers does a great job directing this film too. Just like he just like he directed the previous two films he directed, The Witch and The Lighthouse, two A twenty four films. With The Lighthouse being my personal favorite, like I said. But The Northman is actually not made by A twenty four. It's actually made by Focus Features. Yeah. And of course the acting performances, the performances in this movie were really good too. Like Alexander Skarsgård, Nicole Kidman. Anya Taylor Joy, Ethan Hawke, and Willem Dafoe, like like everyone in this movie did did a great job in this film, and yeah, and and of course this was, I heard this was this was also considered to be Robert Eggers' most violent film because of how much blood there is and how much gore there is, and yeah, and plus it, it's also kind of interesting that that Robert Eggers and Anya Taylor Joy and Willem Dafoe, like all th all three of those people have have worked on on Robert Eggers' the previous two films, like the first two films he worked on. Anya Taylor Joy was in The Witch, and Willem Dafoe was in The Lighthouse. So overall, The Northman is is an awesome movie. And I'm gonna give The Northman four and a half out of five stars. I thought it was definitely an awesome movie from 2022 so far. So if you haven't seen The Northman yet, then and if you and if and if you enjoy Robert Eggers' The Light, The Lighthouse, and The Witch, then I recommend I recommend checking this movie out for sure. So there you have it, guys. That's gonna be it for my movie review on The Northman. And that's going to be it for this video, so make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching, and until next time, this is Mr. A. Crizzy saying goodbye everybody and that's about it.